Good morning and welcome to another morning devotion. As we are on the eve of Mother's Day, I give special tribute to all mothers everywhere, including all mothers who shaped me over the years, but especially to my mother, grandmother, and yes, my mother-in-law, who all have gone home to be with the Lord, but their love still holds. To my wife, Laverne, who mothers our children with tender love and care. To LaShan, who is the mother of our one-year-old adult, Zion, we love you. And to those mothers who are challenged and out of position because of choices made by you or made for you, God still loves you. To wives who are still waiting to conceive, God got you, and like Hannah, put your trust in him. And a word to unmarried ladies, stay chaste, be virgin, God will reward you. And where you have to repent, do it, because God loves you. According to the truth of the Lord, mothers, you are called, appointed, and anointed by God. Paul in his writing to Timothy in 2 Timothy 1.5 states, I am reminded of your sincere faith, which first lived in your grandmother Lois and in your mother Eunice, and I am persuaded now lives in you also. What a position given by God himself to all mothers, to first receive God and his righteousness and then to raise children to be godly leaders. And to the mother of our Lord, she was told, the angel appeared to her and said, greetings, you are highly favored. The Lord is with you. Father, we thank you for mothers everywhere. We praise you for the gift that you've given to us through motherhood. We thank you for the mothers who are on the front line of leadership, those who lead nations today. We pray special grace on them. We pray for those who are on the front line of COVID-19, those mothers who are making a difference. Thank you. Thank you for them today, for their sacrifice, their constant giving those who are essential workers, law enforcement, medical professionals, wherever they are in the front line of this fight, we thank you for that. Thank you for mothers of the church who are called to be godly, righteous, to be good wives, to indeed be good mothers. We pray blessings on them. Even those who lead in the ministry, we pray blessings on mothers everywhere. And God, we ask your forgiveness for those mothers who intentionally are not doing their part. Be merciful to them today and help them to repent and return to their godly, anointed, and appointed position. And now we give you thanks as we seek your forgiveness, Lord, as we seek your healing, as we forgive others who have wronged us. And we pray today that we will live right and righteous, giving you honor, glory, and praise. We ask this in the name of the Father and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen, amen, amen. God bless you today as we prepare to celebrate Mother's on Mother's Day. But be great today to your family as you devote, as focus our attention on the love of mommy. God bless you. Have a great day. In Jesus' name.